during the match, parents, did I mention don't stress out your kid? So if you're watching the match, be careful. The kid's watching you too. Are you, are you standing there with your arms crossed? Are you making faces? Are you jumping up and down? Are you, are you yelling at the, the ref? Are you, are, you, you know, are you doing distracting things? It, it, it could just be your face. You know, be careful with your face. Why do you think coaches, you see like watch Jose Higueras watching a match or watch, watch Juan Carlos Ferrer watching Alcaraz. You know, they got the sunglasses on. They don't show that much usually. I mean, some coaches show more emotion than others, but it's usually positive. You don't see a coach typically in the corner you know, frowning and making faces and looking all cloudy, that's usually not a good sign, not, not good for the player. So as a parent, you got to understand, if you're there watching your kid, you insist on watching the kid's match, you have a right to watch the match. I don't like when kids tell parents not to watch the match. I think the kid should deal with that in most cases, you know. or Sometimes if the kid is so stressed out by the relationship with one parent, I'll have the other parent go, like mo mom or dad could switch in terms of watching the match. Because sometimes the, the stress is like so high for the kid. But usually try to work through it. And just, just as a parent, you have to be aware of like your body language, your facial expressions, what you say, what you're doing over there on the sideline. Be very careful. Don't stress your kid out. Your number one job is to give your kid a, a calm state of mind so your kid can try to play his or her best tennis. You just, you need your kid to be calm. You can't do stuff that stresses out your kid because a stressed out kid gets tight. Stressed out kid does not going to play his, his or her best.